Some people are shielding Mena from arrest, EFCC Chairman Ibrahim Magu reveals. The acting chairman of the EFCC, Ibrahim Magu, has said that some people are protecting the embattled former pension boss, Abdul Rashid Mena. Magu said these people are shielding Mena from arrest and prosecution. He also said that the EFCC is determined to fight corruption to a stop in Nigeria. The acting chairman of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, Ibrahim Magu, has given reasons the commission is yet to arrest the embattled former chairman of the Presidential Task Force on Pension Reform, Abdul Rasid Mena. Migu while speaking during a channel's television program on Monday, October 30, said Mane has people who are shielding him from possible arrest and prosecution. He also said that EFCC operatives were not part of the people protecting the sacked pension boss. Migu said, no, it cannot be. Never. Never. He has people who are protecting him which made it difficult for us to get him arrested. You can imagine that he was promoted. It is very devastating and it is beyond my understanding. Magu however did not give names of those protecting Mena. The EFCCs are confirming that Mena has fled the country said the commission is working with Interpol to ensure his repatriation. He also denied claims that the seizure of Mena's property by the EFCC was reactionary to his ordeal at the Ministry of Interior. He has already been declared wanted by the Interpol and we are going into several countries to request their assistance particularly in Dubai, USA, and UK. We are already on a serious manhunt. When I came in. The matter was already in court and I was so busy pursuing other issues. You need to visit the EFCC to see the volume of work we have. I really don't know what happened but I know he was properly placed on the watch list so he cannot sneak into this country without the knowledge of the law enforcement agencies. So, something is wrong somewhere and I think we need to look at that. It is just terrible and I just cannot believe it, Magu said. Magu further said that the EFCC is fully committed to its mandate which is fighting corruption to a stop in Nigeria. Nage. Com earlier reported that the head of service of the Federation, Winifred Oyewata, said she warned President Muhammadu Buhari against the reinstatement of Mena. Oyewaita in a leaked memo to the president warned about the damaging implication of the recall of Mena on the Buhari's administration's mandate to fight corruption in Nigeria. The letter was sent to the president through his chief of staff, Abakairi.